Mile Gap is all that separates connecting Atlanta's Beltline with the Silver Comet Trail. Connecting the two would give access across the state and into Alabama from the metro. I met with the people who are taking their effort to the top in hopes of getting this done. So we're talking about connecting this. Just as wide as his hand, but it's a six and a half mile stretch of out of service CSX railroad line that has proven itself for years extremely hard to get. You have to have a willing seller. Uh, CSX has been reluctant to uh, abandon a line. Ed McBrayer with the Path Foundation has worked alongside Connect the Comet, an advocacy group spearheaded by Roberta Cook that wants to connect the heavily used Silver Comet Trail, which reaches from Cobb County all the way into Alabama with the hugely popular Beltline that will circle the metro. This would give us pedestrian transportation and recreation and tourism and higher property values. Everybody wins here. Though out of use, the tracks are not officially abandoned. Even though here at Plant Atkinson Road near Atlanta Road in Cobb County, the tracks have been paved over. Here and uh, also on Oakdale Road here. No sign of use, but signs are up to build support for the cause. More than 4,000 signatures were delivered to the governor's office Wednesday in hopes his influence for the greater good can start much needed dialogue, which Cook has worked on tirelessly for more than a decade. CSX, we just want to get them to the table to talk and how we can come to terms. And if we need to buy it, how much does it cost? So I did reach out to CSX for a comment. A response came back this afternoon. They say CSX frequently works with public agencies and nonprofits on rails to trails projects across our network, and we consider the trail proposals on a case by case basis.